Turn over to Proverbs chapter 20 and verse 30. So another, uh, so another mistake parents often make when it comes to disciplining their kids is they sometimes cross a line and go into abuse territory. And a lot of what people do a lot of times, and I personally believe this is taking this verse out of context, but Proverbs 20 verse 30 says, The blueness of a wound cleanseth away evil, so do stripes the inward parts of the belly. All right, they like to bring up the blueness of the wound. Now listen, sometimes, there were many times where my kids had some red back backsides, all right, you know. Sometimes, you know, they might wiggle too much, you might leave a mark somewhere, but I don't believe that the goal should be turning their backsides back in blue. That, if you're, if you're doing it right, that should not happen, all right. If you're spanking right, you're not going to be turning your kids back backsides black and blue i believe here when it's talking about the blueness of the wound here i believe it's talking about punishment for a man okay look what it, look, let's look at a few other verses because it mentions also stripes okay it also mentions stripes here and um look at what it says in i uh, lost my spot verse i think i'm missing a page of my notes what did i do with it I'm, oh, there they are. I'm missing like a whole page. It's And uh, look at verse, uh, Proverbs 10, verse 13. In the lips of him that hath understanding, wisdom is found, but a rod is for the back of him that is void of understanding. Now, we think we're supposed to take a rod to the backs of our children. Is that what the Bible's teaching here? No. What is something they would often do as a punishment in the Bible? That was actually ordained of God. They would often lay stripes on them. They would publicly beat these people. Grown men, Proverbs 17.10 says, A reproof entereth more into a wise man than a hundred stripes into a fool. You know who we often see associated with getting stripes? Are fools. Well, what does the Bible teach? And the Bible says foolishness is bound in the heart of a child, but the rod of correction driveth it far from him. Your kids start out with foolishness in their heart. But the Bible says the rod of correction driveth it far from them. We see in the Bible, you know who's getting the stripes? The fool. That means they weren't getting the rod of correction growing up. The people who are getting the stripes are the fools. The Bible says if you're spanking your kids, you're going to drive foolishness out of them. The fool gets the stripes. The fool is the one who grows up never having learned his lesson, never having been taught right, He's the one getting the stripes. These are, I believe, grown men. Proverbs 26, 3 says, A whip for the horse, a bridle for the ass, a rod for the fool's back. In Deuteronomy 25, verse 1, I don't have time to go to all examples, but it says, If there be a controversy between men, and they come unto judgment, that the judges may judge them, that they shall justify the righteous and condemn the wicked, and it shall be, if the wicked man be worthy to be beaten, that the judge shall cause him to lie down and to be beaten before his face according to his fault by a certain number, 40 stripes he may give him and not exceed, lest if he should exceed and beat him above these with many stripes, then thy brother should seem vile unto thee. So we see that stripes and the rod for the back, those things were for the fool. Those were for the evil man. It's not for just a kid being bad. Evil is when you're doing harm to people. Okay, and when you do evil, the Bible, God ordained government for the punishment of evildoers. For those who are hurting other people, for those who are committing crimes, that was one of the punishments is they were getting beaten. And when we're seeing this passage about the blueness of the wound, I don't believe it's talking about for children right here. I believe this is talking about for the evildoers, for the lawbreakers, for the fools, for the people who grew up in a home where they didn't get disciplined, and now they're a scourge on society, they're stealing, they're hurting other people, they're abusing other people, you take those people, and you know what? You do make them back in blue. Why? It doesn't help them, but the simple will see it and beware. You smite the scorner, so the simple will see it, and they will fear, and they will learn from those things. And as a parent, I don't want that happening to my kids. I don't want my kids going to jail. We don't do, you know, stripes on people these days. We'll throw them in jail. But you know what? You know who we put in jail? Fools. You ever read why some people get thrown in jail? It's like these people are idiots. These people are fools. Why? 
because it was not the foolishness was not driven out of them with the rod of correction by the parents. So you know what? They get the blueness of the wound. They get the stripes. That's what they get, or in our society, they get the jail time. 